After careful study, we've decided to rebuild it with full preservation and restoration of the exterior to become the second temple of the Church in the city of Provo. Suddenly, we could see what the Lord had always known. He didn't cause the fire, but He allowed the fire to strip away the interior. He saw the tabernacle as a magnificent temple, a permanent home for making sacred, eternal covenants. The Lord allows us to be tried and tested, sometimes to our maximum capacity. We have seen the lives of loved ones, and maybe our own, figuratively burned to the ground and have wondered why a loving and caring Heavenly Father would allow such things to happen. But He doesn't leave us in the ashes. He stands with open arms, eagerly inviting us to come to Him. He is building our lives into magnificent temples where His Spirit can dwell eternally. In Doctrine and Covenants 58, 3-4, the Lord tells us, Ye cannot behold with your natural eyes for the present time the design of your God concerning those things which shall come hereafter and the glory which shall follow after much tribulation.